Snow drifted through the streets, and now that it was dusk, Christmas trees glittered in the windows. Helping her mother make tamales, Maria happily kneaded the masa. She felt all grown up wearing her mother's apron. Her mother had even let her wear lipstick and perfume. If only I could wear my mother's beautiful diamond ring, thought Maria. I'll wear the ring for just a minute, she said to herself. Maria returned to kneading the sticky masa. Her father also joined in to spread the masa onto the corn husk. They made 24 tamales in all. As family arrived, the children ran upstairs to play. After a few moments went by, Maria noticed that her mother's ring was missing. Oh no, Maria sobbed and she quickly ran into the kitchen. The ring must be inside one of these tamales. You must help me, Maria said, and the children began to eat the tamales. Be sure not to eat my mother's beautiful ring, Maria scolded her cousins. Finally, the last tamal was left, but there was no sign of the ring. Didn't any of you bite something hard? Maria asked. Danny, Maria's youngest cousin, frowned. I think I swallowed something, he said. If you want to know how the story ends, read Too Many Tamales, written by Gary Soto.